focus 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 on me hey guys what's up it's Amy I'm back with another video today I'm gonna to be showing you how I do this look that's on my face right now uh, it's kind of like an everyday look when I'm not at work like if I'm going out running errands shopping going out to eat I will leave a link down below of my everyday like work makeup routine it's a little bit different it's not as much makeup but it's still kind of similar I will leave a link down below for you guys to check it out I did it a few months ago and if you want to see an updated one just leave a comment down below and I'll be happy to do that but yeah if you want to see how I got this look just keep on watching okay so I start by moisturizing my face and today I'm gonna to be using this Lancome 24 hour moisturizer and my AC just turned on and then I take my boom Lancome 24 hour makeup foundation and I am in the color 420 bisque just put a little bit of that on my hand and then I'll put it on my face Sometimes I use the brush and then sometimes I'll go back in with the actual um, beauty blender because brushes seem to leave like harsh lines. And I put it all over my face including my eyelids. Anastasia's um, beauty blender. I actually got this free when I bought my Anastasia glow kit. I just blend it out. Make sure there's no harsh lining from you know, the foundation. Okay, so I use two different types of concealers. So I have this first one. It's by Maybelline, and it's in the color Deep Fonce. And I put that under, like right under my eye, the darker color. And then I put this lighter color from Lancome. I think it's the color Honey. And I put that under just to make it like, um, I don't know, I like the way it highlights your eyes, the two tones. So I start out by putting this under my eye. That's too much. And then I take that same wet beauty blender and I blend that out. I take the Lancome Honey Concealer, put a little bit of that on my hand, like literally a little bit. So then I'm going to be taking this brush. I don't know where it's from. I got it from a beauty supply store. And I just take a little bit of that and put it like a triangle under my eye. Then I also take the same one and put it on my eyelid for a primer for my eyeshadow. I like to let the concealer sit a little bit just so it can get cakey so it will stay on a little better instead of me just like dabbing it all out because I have really deep under eye circles and I freaking hate it. What I do. I line down my nose. Do this little X on my forehead. I also take some right here because I get like blemishes and stuff around my nose. Cover those up a bit. I like to set all of that with a little bit of setting powder 
And I have the Sasha Buttercup setting powder. I let this sit. I'm going to be using the Naked 2 palette. There is a hair and this is breaking. Get up. Okay. First I'm going to be going in with the color Suspect from the Naked 2 palette. That's way too much. Okay, I just put that all over my lid. with the color snake bite. came with the naked palette it has like two ends to it I'm gonna use the smaller end to get into like what is this part called of your eye like the crease this is not a crease get into the edges of my eye and I'm using the color half naked And I'm going to use Foxy and I'm going to mix it with Booty Call. Apply that to my cheeks in an upward motion, and then I do the other side. And then I take a little bit, and then I put it on my nose. The bridge of my nose. I'm gonna go in with the sunburst on my eyelid, whatever this is called, under my eyebrow, just to brighten up my eye a bit. I'm going to be taking my Smashbox Photo Finish Lash Primer, and this just like sets your eyelashes for greatness. <laughs> my Estee Lauder Sumptuous Extreme Lash Multiplying Volume Mascara. And this is in the color Extreme Black. Okay, so now that my face is complete, I'm gonna go and do some stuff with my lips. I'm not like big into lipstick and stuff. I'm trying to start. It's just really hard because I suck. I suck at applying lipstick. And I feel like when I'm out and about, people are gonna be crazy. Like, oh my god, why her lips that color? Why her lips that color? 
Now my lips are already moisturized. I already put chapstick and all that on earlier. This is just really hard because it's so pink for me and I'm so scared of pink. showing y'all what I do what I do all right all right guys that is the finished look this is like my everyday if I'm not going to work look minus my hair this is different I've never done this before I just didn't feel like combing it so that's why it's flex like that I just want to thank you guys for watching and I hope you enjoyed this video. If you have any suggestions of what video I should do next, you should leave a comment down below. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up. And yeah, I'll see you guys next week.